back to another video. Hey, I'm Lizanne. If you're new, welcome to my channel. I am happy to have you. We are back with another episode of Lizaween. This is episode four, and I am kind of excited for this episode. I'm, I'm going to be creating a moon, loon, whatever you want to call it, a luna, luna witch, moon witch. I'm going to be creating a look, makeup look. I already did the makeup look, so stay tuned to see how I got this. And I'm going to talk about what a moon witch is and what they do, a little bit about what they do. And I will do a little outfit reveal of my take on a moon witch outfit. So, yeah. Let's finish this makeup look and let's get started into Lizaween episode four.
So, I already, as you guys see, the montage of this makeup look looks kind of moony and galaxy. I absolutely love it. It's blue, so it makes my blue eyes pop. I didn't have any blue or black lipstick, which would be perfect for a moon witch. So I just went and created my own with a pink and a purple. So to finish off this look, we are going to be drawing some moons on my face. I am not very good at drawing a moon, so bear with me. I am not very I am not very good at drawing star at drawing moons. So I might just leave the one moon. I'm gonna give myself some stars in my face. Mostly just filling in my freckles. She a moon witch on Pinterest that had lines like this on her head. So we'll do that. Okay, and then moving on to hair because I'm done. <laughs> And then we'll talk about a little bit what a moon witch is, and then I will show you guys my costume. So for my hair, I'm going to take this flower out. For my hair, what I'm going to do is, surprise, surprise, we're going to do braids. Because to me, don't quote me on this, but to me, being a witch 
I find the most witchy hairstyle is some sort of braids. So we are going to do two braids in the front, but one's going to be pinned back or something with my, I'm going to put my moon quartz somewhere too, my hat. And then we just we just make it wider. And then do the same to the other side. Elastic in. And then again, we do this to tighten it. Not tighten it, to make it bigger. And then I'm going to take my moon clip. And I'm literally just going to. Put it in the braid. Like so. And then I have this star. And then pull through on this side. So, okay, so that is it for hair, and we will also have on my witch hat when I show you the outfit. It is the Lunar Witch look, makeup. Okay, so before we get into the rest of this video, I'm going to show you guys a little bit about, I'm going to tell you guys a little bit about what a moon witch is. So a moon witch works with the lunar cycles, which is the moon. They honor the moon and they love to work at night under the moon's energy. The moon gives off amazing energy for doing spells and everything, so moon lunar witches love to work underneath the moon uh they love to collect moon water um i have moon water right here absolutely love to collect moon water let me know in the comments uh, down below if you would like me to do a video on how to collect moon water and what you can use it for and i will gladly do it um they also like to wear like moon pendants and stuff like that. I don't really have a moon pendant, so I usually wear this in the star. And they also love to charge their crystals in the moon's energy because again, the moon the energy from the moon is very powerful. So it charges your crystals really well. I absolutely love to charge my crystals in the moon. Charge in the moon, cleanse them in the sun. It's absolutely perfect. Um, a lunar witch, again, loves to work in the dark. It, they're usually night owls. I'm a night owl. I prefer night rather than day. Pers their personality changes with the moon phases. I've noticed that within myself, yes. Um, and moon witches, they were drawn to the sea. Uh, the crystals used for moon witch are opel. I'll put the right here. I'm probably saying it wrong. Um, I don't have one of those to show off, but it aids in psych psychic vision. 
It's great for emotional sta stabilizer through all moon phases. And acelatine, um, I don't have one of those, but it pinpoints lessons, issues that are still unfinished, and it's great for meditation and it, cle and it clears your aura. And then the next one is Moonstone, and I do have one of those. This is a Moonstone. And a Moonstone helps you to utilize your body's natural cycles, and it carries the energy of a new moon. And a clear quartz, which you can use to substitute any crystal in any spell, but it also works for the moon. It magnifies your intentions energies and activates all your chakras and it increases spiritual wisdom and that is it for a little bit on a lunar witches so let's get back to flying on my lunar witch outfit. so that's it for this lunar witch makeup fashion look video i hope you guys enjoyed leave your comments down below Give this video a big thumbs up. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Those are always down there. Subscribe to be an Elizinator. We'd be happy to have you. And always remember that a little magic always goes a long way. And I will speak to you guys in Lizaween episode 5. Bye guys! Bye.